Now at 5.30, a son serving in World War II wrote a letter to his mother from overseas, but it would be more than 75 years before anyone received it. Reporter Christine McCarthy has a story from Massachusetts where Army Sergeant John Gonzalez's widow shared what it said. That's the address and everything. Imagine that. 76 years. Angelina Gonzalves didn't even know this letter existed. I couldn't believe it and then just his handwriting and everything, you know, it was just so amazing. On December 6, 1945, months after World War II ended, a 22-year-old Army sergeant she had yet to meet penned a note to his mother in Woburn while he was overseas in Germany. It says, Dear Mom, received another letter from you today and was happy to hear that everything is okay. As for myself, I'm fine and getting along okay. But as far as the food, it's pretty lousy. That letter was lost in the mail, long forgotten, until late last year when it suddenly and inexplicably showed up in a Pittsburgh Postal Service facility. John had died six years before, his mom long gone, so it would be delivered to his next of kin, the bride he left behind. The mailman came and he said, um, was your husband in the service? And I said, yes, he was. And he said, well, I think I have a letter for you. And I said, really? After the war, Angelina and John married and settled in Woburn. They raised five children and were happily married for 61 years. He was a good man. He really was. Everybody loved him. Angelina, who turns 90 this month, finds comfort reading these sweet words from a brave son to his worried mother. At the end, he said, love and kisses your son Johnny. I'll be seeing you soon, I hope, which I thought was wonderful. A letter from the past, the best present that could be delivered. It's like he came back to me, you know, really. That was amazing.